Good morning, everybody, and welcome to day 28 of winter. So we are on our last day of winter. This is the third year on this farm, uh, as you can tell by the amount of furniture and decor in this house. Um, we have finished out the winter and are just going to spend the day doing some basic errands. Check the weather, not that it's necessary, because the first day of s the new season is always a beautiful sunny day. Uh, we've got fortune teller coming in saying that the spirits are somewhat annoyed, so probably not a mining day, although we could risk it. And queen of sauce, of course. Which I already know all the recipes, so I don't know why I opened that. Alright, diamonds. Do I need diamonds? Oh, heck no, I don't need diamonds. Let's uh, sell a pile. So, anyway, this is my charming little house. We've got our living space with assorted uh, flowers and gems for gifts. A fake nautical slash knight themed medieval. No, that's not. I have no idea what era that knight armor is from. Uh, weird little sitting room thing. The upstairs bedroom, which you really can't really move the beds or anything, so it's uh, just a bedroom. A little kitchen with all four refrigerators so that I have all the recipes, the, the ingredients I need for cooking. Uh, my first tea plant. I put one in here and the other nine are in the greenhouse. The one in here helps me remember that I need to go pick these every day that last week of the season. And of course, um, pre-cooked things and... Uh, various pickles and honeys and such and whatnot. Alright, so we're gonna go down into the cellar, which I have filled in. I don't like doing the, you know, I'm not so concerned about uh, maximizing that I do the full uh, cellar. This is probably the one of the easier to use layouts I've done. Um, all my cheeses are in groups of four, and all the wines and beers that are, um, which are, and pretty much the cheeses are just like this little bit here. Um, uh, everything else is wine or beer that's aging, and it's in groups of five, uh, because I can do two rows against a wall and still have uh, access to the back row there. So, we're gonna go upstairs. Uh, these are to sell. I'll tuck that down there for later. Oh, I did forget to put that away. I snagged these last night from outside to add to my collection here. First things first, we're going to have a triple shot espresso. Good lord. Um, Just to speed us up a little bit, we're gonna sell our snail and all five of our five crayfish. That's amazing. Uh, hang on to the newspaper. Uh oh. I see that we are out of hay for my dear friends here. So we're gonna. <laughs> That's better. I hope I didn't miss that yesterday. Well, I've still got hearts. I don't have any angry... Mouse looks really happy today. I... my name... Usually I try to name on a theme. Like I have one that's all Austin characters. One that's all Redwall characters. And... Uh... One that's all Haikyuu volleyball players. <laughs> because I'm that nerd. Um, but this one, I just decided, you know what? Forget it. We're just going to do cute names. I don't care about keeping any kind of other theme. Except, of course, my dinosaur is always called Suki. Because uh, I can't help it. Anyone from Haikyuu will get the reference. Or anyone who likes Haikyuu will probably get the reference to Tsukushima and his love of dinosaurs. But, holy smokes! Oh, it's 
Wine day. That's excellent. Alright, so we're gonna grab. Oh, duh. And be finished. Uh, let's see. Goat cheese. There we are. Alright, let's grab all of these. Good gracious. No, not that. Alright, so I have one piece of trash to throw in the recycler. I have some raw materials and some not so raw materials. 75, oh that's lovely. It's 55 and 20, I think I keep 20 to age and I sell 55. If I remember correctly how I set this particular one up, we'll see. Oh, might help if I remembered though. To fill the rest of the kegs. part for me I'm trying to see whether the kegs are moving or not but we have 75 kegs and we started with 126 ancient fruit so we should end with what, 51 51 I believe uh, ancient fruit left there we are and hey my recycler finished right at the same time too so, next time I have to do my ancient fruit, unless I get another harvest that bumps us back up above 75, I will have to start going into my uh, silver and gold star ancient fruit. This has all been on the uh, unstarred uh, fruit thus far, which is amazing. I say all all since I've started a regular production of it. Obviously when you first start with the ancient fruit you don't quite have enough to stick with one or the other. But now that my entire greenhouse is full of it, and yes I know min-maxers that pale ale with the hops is a more efficient oops, sorry about that, is a more efficient way to do um, you get more money it's more bang for your buck um, but it also is a whole of a lot more work and I I don't I don't play this to min max I kind of play it for the fun so I like the ancient fruit in my greenhouse so I keep the ancient fruit in my greenhouse that that's it. That's the entirety of my, my reasoning there. Is I just I do it because I like it. Alright, so we have all ten of our tea leaves have been picked. And we've got some wool that needs to be woven into cloth. I think my mother would appreciate this. She's recently gotten me into fiber arts specifically weaving is her thing right now. You know what? I'm actually going to do this slightly differently. Uh, no, I don't. There we go. Alright, I'm going to sell 35 and I'm actually going to keep 40 because I am running low on things to age. I got 20 pale ale and I had no wine left so there now we've got 60 which will last us for a while because it does take I think a full season to age the the wines and the ales I ought to do a thing of mead as well because that is just like the uh, 
pale ale, I think, is a single day. Or no, pale ale is two days. Mead is a single day. Uh, it's not worth as much, but it's nice. Again, I like having a variety. Alright, so I have no quests. So let's go see if there are any uh, favors I can do for anybody in the town. We're gonna give it a shot. So it's 3.30 in the afternoon. So Harvey's clinic is already closed. Besides, I've already taken him as many presents as you can. Oh no, it's Sunday. Oh, it's Sunday. I could start giving people presents again. Eh. We'll wait. It's the first of the year. It'll be spring tomorrow. I can give everybody daffodils or something. Blah. My front yard's a mess. Oh, I'm sorry, Pam. I did my best to clean it up. But, you know, there's only so much we're allowed to do here. Well, at least she liked the espresso. It's cold out. She probably wants something warm. Oh, there's Jody and Kent headed back from church. Or whatever their uh, Sunday service is. For albacore. Uh, I'll accept it, but I probably won't do it. Uh, we'll see what happens. I've, I do that fairly frequently. Doesn't look like it affects your affection levels, so... Hey, Maru. It's so sleepy when it's cold. You and me both, sister. Alright. Maru is one I'm not sure if I want to marry. Not... But you know what? I love the... Uh, is it 10 heart or 8 heart that you get the astronomy? The, the stargazing date. I do like that. I do like the stargazing date. I'm not big on the mad scientist thing. The uh, the robot was a weird, a weird cutscene. All right, I really should scrub my floorboards today. I think an algae is starting to form. Oh dear, Elliot. Yes, you need to scrub your floorboards. Do you make time for cleaning? Uh, not as much as I should, but I do. Uh, I'm talking real life, obviously, in the game I have no control over whether or not my character cleans. I would like to think that this Miss Anne is very very neat and tidy, particularly since on a farm you kind of need to be. There's a lot of dirt and manure and things coming in and out of your house when you're a farmer. It's my skipper Anne! Oh, Willie's so sweet. I'd give you a discount on bait if I could afford it. Oh, no problem, Willie. I probably ought to... Uh, that's what I ought to do with all that bait. I have more bait than will fit in my fishing pole. I ought to sell some to Willie. And if I could, I'd sell it to him on the super cheap. Uh, because... He's just a sweetheart. I know I sacrificed my perfect for that. Oh, that is not what I expected. A sea cucumber. And look at that. A bait again. Fine. Let's see if we get another cucumber. Hmm? Oh, blast. I lost my perfect again. Nope. Sardine this time. I will say it took me like a year of playing this, two years of playing this, and and several save files before I figured out that you could direct your hook with your arrow keys. Uh, I, or you know, years before this, I the first the first three save files I had, I would have just ignored those bubbles because they're not in the spot where I could reach them because they're behind a pole. But it makes so much more sense now that I know what I know. He didn't put up any kind of a fight. That was another sea cucumber. What on earth? Oh, I've lost my bubbles. 
it's not that you have to do the fishing where you've got bubbles, but uh, I'm just impatient. Over there and over there. There we go. Uh, my inventory is all organized, and yes, I constantly organize my inventory. It bothers me otherwise. And it's quite easy in this game. I mean, there's a tool that organizes it for you, but I'm not a fan of the organizational system that they put in it, so I do my own. And it helps me figure out where I've got things, and when I get back to the farm, it's much easier to put everything away. It just works out. Oh, that was a double sea urchin. That's quite fun. Got a mussel and an oyster. And another mussel. No cockles, so I'm not going to sing the song. Alright. Uh, up we go. Into the wild blue yonder. No, not really. Let's see. It is Sunday evening. There may be some folks at the bar I can go say hi to. Oh, look at this. I need a little warm me up to be ready for another cold night on the ocean. Oh, why don't I buy everybody around? Um, do about eight of those. A handful of those. Call it good. Here. Oh, I've given Pam a gift today. Oh, yes, because I. I did? Oh, yes, I gave her an espresso. Oil. She was out in the cold. Do you ever take a whole day off? Uh, yes, Leah. I, I fairly frequently. Well, my character probably doesn't, but she's a farmer. That doesn't really work. It's a refreshing break. Well, I'm sure that it is. Here. I figured you'd like a beer. Marnie, sigh. I wasn't very productive today. You and me both, honey. Here. I know you're drinking wine, but have a beer. Oh, sorry, I already talked to Willie. Uh, let's give him a beer. This looks great, thank you. How about you, Clint? How are your tools holding up? I didn't mean to show them off, <laughs> sorry. Here, have a beer. This is a fun gift, thanks. Aw, thank you. Harvey, hi honey. I hate to say this, but I do make a lot more money during flu season. I guess if people stopped getting sick, I'd be out of business. Don't get the wrong idea. I want people to be healthy. Really. Oh, I believe you, darling. It's for me? This is my favorite stuff. It's like you've read my mind. Oh, I just know you so well. If I watch more TV, maybe I can forget about life. That would be relaxing. Oh, sweetheart. Here. Have a coffee. Not that that solves anything. Folks, don't, don't. Um, not that that solves anything, uh, you know, but, uh, coffee may not actually sober you up, but, um, probably preferable to beer if you're feeling down, since alcohol is a depressant. Experiencing depression, probably not best to, walk to exacerbate it. Exacerbate it. Good gracious, I can't talk this evening. I'm just not used to speaking uninterrupted for so long. All right. So we have seeds, stone, dirt. It's clay. Looks like dirt. It's supposed to be clay. All right, up we go. I will say this is my favorite new button. And if any other game with an inventory, and I'm looking at you, Animal Crossing, wanted to do a very straightforward update, 
that would be one of them. It doesn't do everything, obviously. And in, and in other games where you don't really stack things as much, it probably wouldn't be as effective. But Oh, good golly, I love it. Alright, so we have Ancient Fruit Jelly, because I was bored, I guess, of other things. Mayonnaise, the cheese to go in the fridge. The two that are going to go be uh, dropped in the cellar to age. Those are all for selling in the morning, and I am going to sell them tomorrow so that I don't uh, screw up my daily takings. It's nice to have kind of a steady daily income. Uh, I actually prefer that to the one big lump sum you get with some of these other... Don't get me wrong, I love the lump sum on top of... on top of my uh, usual monetary intake, but... Uh, if I had to choose, I would uh, go with something a bit more standard and a little less so. Uh, with with a, a bit less fluctuation, rather is the word I was looking for. Alright, so you're going up and you two are going in here. Bye! Oh no, not you two, just you one! I need you, actually. I feel like there's uh, a recipe that I have been avoiding because I did not think I had the ingredients. But I believe that those are the ingredients. Oh, see, I already had beer in the fridge. Or in the thing here. Uh, that's alright. Won't hurt anybody. Oh, and my tea. I brewed five more cups of tea. Which I love that everybody in town is like, ooh, tea, thank you. <laughs> Such a nice thing, because tea should be a wonderful thing that you say thank you for. Alright. So. Throw my tools down here so I can easily get to... I know that we have this um, tab function, but I just, I've gotten used to dropping things down below. I already said hello to Smidge. Okay. Go to sleep for the night? Yes, thank you. Well, that was a productive day. You can see, even though we only sold a little bit, uh, less than half of the uh, of the ancient fruit wine that we got today, and it's not aged, it's just straight out of the barrel. We're still up above broke 100,000 just for today, so that's kind of nice. Well, thank you very much for uh, tagging along with me again. And uh, I hope we'll see you all again soon. So from the little uh, alien spaceship and I, have a lovely night.